So here we're looking at a coloured plastic skull from a superior point of view. We can see on the anterior aspect, the frontal bone, just posterior to that, two parietal bones. So between the two parietal bones, we have a sagittal suture. Uh, between the frontal and parietal bones, we have a coronal suture. So that would be in a coronal plane. Of course, the sagittal suture is in the mid-sagittal or median plane. Then if we look to a lateral point of view on this coloured skull, we can see here between the temporal and parietal bones a squamous or squamous suture. So that's that one you can see there. And then if we have a look at the same features on a real skull, they look a little different, but essentially uh, the same. Here we've got the frontal bone and two parietal bones. So here's the sagittal suture. And just notice that here, there's a lot of interdigitation there. It's a very, it's not just a straight, a straightish line like it was on the plastic skull. Looks a little different. Here, of course, we have the coronal suture. And then, if we bring in the rest of this skull, we can see on the lateral aspect here, a squamous suture. We can see that line there. That's between the temporal and parietal bones. 